to Hofstra University here in beautiful Hempstead, Long Island. I am Lara Spencer, inviting you to join us in the celebration of music, youth, and America as ABC7 presents Newsday's 39th annual Marching Band Festival. Let the music begin. participate in the festival. It is a very popular event here on Long Island. It runs three nights long and it's been going 39 years strong. Susan Schneider, she is the chairman for this entire festival, and it's important that we don't call it a competition. No, it's not a competition, it's a festival, so all bands participate. There's no winner tonight, they're all winners. There's no judging, it's just a fun night for everyone. Really, everybody's a winner here? Yes, everybody's a winner. And they all can get to see other bands as well. So therefore, when the normal competitions, bands are not in the area to see what's going on. How do they decide who plays what, who goes when? Well, the band directors decide what they play. They pick a theme and they develop their own show in their home school. As far as the order, the band directors for each night get together and determine who's going to go first. Basically, each year the bands develop and do more intricate dance routines, more choreography, more precision marching, and harder music, and each year it continues to develop. They want to showcase what they've been working on for the past three months and tonight's supposed to be a happy night and a fun night for everybody. If you had to give a prize, it would be hard to do. You couldn't possibly. And you also have in competition, you have bands that are three different sizes. You have class A, double AA, A, triple A. And now it doesn't matter if the band is 42 or 242. They're all considered equal out here tonight.
center stage for many ceremonies and memorials to honor those who died on September 11th. For those who've come to the festival, it's a chance to salute the country and its heroes. I can take your tickets here. Thank you. On the drill. It's very important that we get back out and do our, everything again. Uh, it's very patriotic. I, I actually tribute this to uh, the World Trade Center. Oceanside changed their program to, pay, uh, to last piece being patriotic. Uh, since the um, September 11th, uh, they changed it to uh, the Battle Hymn of the Republic, I guess, to uh, try to keep us all together. I'm just looking forward to us doing really well and showing them how good we can be. It is definitely more special, definitely. This is cool, this is really cool. This is the time to do it. Last weekend was homecoming and it was a big weekend for us. It was exciting and now that we're here, it's even better. Well, everybody's psyched to be here. Yeah! Yeah, Valley Stream North, boo! A city! I think they're trying, you know, to overcome what has happened, you know. So hopefully. <laughs> I'm looking forward to hearing us, hearing all the other bands, and cheering on everyone and having fun. Stay with us because we'll be right back with trumpets, xylophones, and much, much more.